Hi everybody, how are you doing? My name is Alec. I'm the high school youth minister here at Calvary Chapel Las Vegas. Again, I'm so blessed to bring you another Devo out of Psalms 20. Uh, we are going to be looking at verses 4 and 5 today. Um, and I really think what God has for us today is really just a, an amazing truth that we need to hold on to for this day. He says in verse 4 of, of Psalms 20, this is David writing, May he grant you, he's speaking of God, may he grant you according to your heart's desire and fulfill all your purpose. We will rejoice in your salvation and in the name of our God, we will set up our banners. May the Lord fulfill all your petitions. If you're like me, I remember reading this for the first time um, right when I had gotten saved. And I remember reading and being like, how is God going to fulfill all of my desires? Some of my desires are not good. And some of my desires, I hope that God doesn't fulfill. How is it all up to me? How is he going to fulfill all of my petitions? And over time, God showed me a very beautiful thing about the process of sanctification. One of the amazing things that God does is he puts his desires in our hearts. It's so beautiful to think that the creator of the world not only saved you from, you know, it from eternal damnation, but he also um, gives you the desires that he wants in your hearts. He begins to mold and shape your heart and to make you more like him. I don't know if that encourages encourages you today, but what but that really encourages me because it tells me something about God. It tells me that God loves us so much that he wants us to desire what he desires. He loves us so much that the God of the universe takes time out of you know, his day, even though you know he is never too busy for us. He takes time to not only tell us where we're supposed to go, give us purpose in our life, save us, and do all these amazing things, but he also puts that desire in our hearts. I don't know if that encourages you. I hope it does because the reality is as you grow more like Jesus, as you grow more like God, the desires that you have in your heart will be the same as God's. I think that is such a, a powerful word for today because we are on this path, path of sanctification. And I just want to encourage us with this. We must seek to be more like God. We must spend our day to seek his will for our life. I remember I was in Bible college and I was seeking what God's will for my life. I thought that was um, knowing what the future was, but it wasn't. God spoke to me and said, you just need to seek me today and I will take care of tomorrow. God will bless you when you seek him with the day you have and he will put the desires in your heart that he wants for your life. May God bless you. I hope this encourages you. Have a great day.